potatoes. They're an amazing food source and a crop loved by many. They single-handedly prevented an entire country from collapsing and are in most households in the modern world. However, the humble potato is not invincible. It is susceptible to many different pests and diseases, which can seriously harm both the crop and other things around it. One of these diseases is the potato spindle tuber viroid, or PSTVD. It's a virus, and its main target is potato tubers. It acts just like a normal virus does, infecting and or hijacking various cells in order to reproduce. From this, it can cause reduced growth, reduced yield, irregular shaping, thinner stems and leaf distortions. Being a virus, it usually requires a host to live, but there have been several cases of PSTVD surviving outside of a host for around two years. This disease can spread across potatoes through contact with each other. This means that direct contact of infected tubers with non-infected tubers can spread the disease, as well as contact with contaminated machinery or tools. It can also spread through generations through infected tubers. This disease is a pain to deal with and can survive in most environments with its preferred environment being somewhere warm and full of nutrients. A pest that majorly affects potato crops is the potato tuber moth. This pest damages leaves, roots and stems. Mines on leaves are major indicators of the presence of the potato tuber moth. The pest weakens and eventually break the stem of the potato plant. Identification of the pest presence is usually only possible by opening up the potato tuber and looking inside. The potato tuber moth has four stages of life. Egg, larvae, pupa, and adult. This life cycle can last from anywhere between 17 and 125 days. The pest is transmitted by wind up to 250 meters to further infect more potato crops. The potato tuber moth does not leave the plant until the plant is harvested. The pest thrives in subtropical, warmer weather. Despite how powerful and dangerous these enemies are, there are methods to reduce their impact as well as prevent them entirely. These methods are considered under biosecurity, an important part of any farm. One of the simplest ways to avoid these issues is by simply being more prudent towards crops and seeds from outside your farm. By inspecting each item carefully, you are capable of removing the undesirables. Also, sanitation of equipment and tools significantly reduces the chance of diseases affecting your potatoes. There is also the secret ultimate ally of all crops, pesticides. These chemicals are capable of being extremely powerful and some are capable of destroying entire populations of pests and diseases. They are also often custom tailored to specific pests so they can be even more effective at taking them down while leaving innocent beings alone. Through careful use and proper timing, you can maintain an extremely healthy farm.